Hi everyone, I'm Richie, the DJ, popularly known as Kepsi. Welcome to my YouTube channel, Rich Brain. Please remember to subscribe to the YouTube channel and hit the notification bell so that anytime I share a video, you'll be the first to receive. We are coming to talk about cactus, and on this we'll be doing differentiation. I will take you through a simple differentiation rule, and after that, I will solve one last equation on differentiation. Come with me. So differentiation simply is the gradient of the curve. Differentiation is also referred to as the derivative of a function. So for instance, if I have a function y equals to a x exponent n, where our y is the dependent variable, x is the independent variable, a is the coefficient of the, of the variable x and n is the exponent. And we are asked to differentiate this. A simple differentiation rule is saying that let the power multiply the coefficient of the independent variable and reduce the power by one. That is a simple differentiation rule. So to differentiate this does the change in y over the change in s or dy by dx is equal to a times n x exponent n minus 1. Thus, we let the n multiply the a, then we subtract 1 from the, the power, or reduce the power by 1. Now, how do we apply this? If I have an equation of the curve as let's say 5s exponent 3, and I'm asked to find the gradients, this, to apply the differentiation rule, we say that we draw the exponent to multiply the coefficient of the variable. So we can say 5 times 3, x, then we reduce the power by 1, 3 minus 1. So this natural will be 5 times 3, 15, and s exponent 2. This becomes the gradient of this scale, or the derivative of this scale. Now, let's go to a much higher question. For instance, if y is equal to 6s exponent 4 plus 3s exponent 2 plus 7x, and we are asked to find the gradient of this scale. That's dy over dx. So drop the power, the differentiation rule to 6 by 4 and reduce the power by 1, so 4 minus 1, plus drop the power here to 3 times 2, and reduce the power by 1, 2 minus 1. Remember, the power here is 1. So when we drop it, we can get 7 times 1. Then we reduce the power by 1. So to polish this, we get 24s exponent 3, plus 6x because 2 minus 1 is 1 and s exponent 1 is x plus 7s exponent 0 and 7 exponent 0 is 1 so we can get 24s exponent 3 plus 6s plus this becomes the gradient of this game okay so, about differentiating maybe a linear term like this, people get confused how to differentiate this. It's simple. Anytime you differentiate a linear term, the answer is just the coefficient of the variable. So, if y is equal to 7x, or I divide by the x, it's nothing but 7. If I have y equals to negative 24x dy over ds is nothing but the coefficient which is negative 24. 
the differentiation of the linear term is the coefficient of the variable. Now, the differentiating of the constant is always zero. So, if I have y equal to 2, and I'm asked to find the gradient, that's zero over this, it's nothing but zero. So, if I have y equal to, let's say, 7x exponent 4 plus 3x exponent 3 plus 2x exponent 2 plus 7x then plus 6 and I'm asked to find the gradient the gradient which is dy by dx to the differentiation we drop the power to multiply the coefficient 7 by 4 we reduce the power by 1 and that become 3 we drop this power here 3 times 3 we reduce the power by 1 and that becomes 2 plus we drop, we, mod, we let the power multiply the coefficient which is 4 and reduce the power by 1, that would be 1 then the differentiation of the linear term is the coefficient and the differentiation of the constant is called a 0 so how we call it this? we will get 7 times 8 which is 28 x to the 3 plus 9 x squared plus 4 x plus 7 this becomes a gradient of this curve. So, as I promised you, we we'll solve one last equation. And they say find the gradient at a point P on the curve y equal to 3x squared minus 2x plus 4 at s equal to 4. So, remember, I told you from the beginning that the gradient is a differentiation of the curve. So, first, let's differentiate our curve. Our curve is 3x squared minus 2s plus 4 so a differential divided by ds we let the power multiply the coefficient of the variable which is 3 times 2 we reduce the power by 1 that will become 1 <coughs> differentiation of a linear term the answer is the coefficient of the variable and the differentiation of the constant is 0 so on policy this we get 6x minus 2 but they ask for a value not an equation in this form so at the point where x is 4 so in any place we see x in the gradient function we substitute 4 to find our gradient so our divide by dx is equal to 6 by 4 minus 2 6 by 4 24 minus 2 24 minus 2 is 22 so the gradient of this curve at the point s equal to 4 is 22. So I hope you understand, and this will, will help someone who is preparing for us. Remember, just subscribe to the YouTube channel if you are not. If you have not done that, share my video and hit the notification bell. And anytime I share a video, you'll be the first to receive it. Thank you. God bless.